Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Without a doubt, Poblacion Makati has long been known for its vibrant nightlife. Pero baka ikagulat nyo malaman na masaya rin pala mapasyal dito during the daytime dahil sagana ang area sa restaurants at coffee shops na maaga magbukas. Just like Haponesa, isang Japanese-Peruvian restaurant and bar na open na rin ngayon for lunch. Matatagpuan ang Haponesa sa 5658 Jacobo Corner Don Pedro Street. If this address is familiar to you, it's because dating location ito ng Pura Vida na lumipat na sa may Kalayaan Ave. The ambience here is trendy casual. Kapansin-pansin ang South American design elements sa color palette ng interiors, lalo na pagdating sa distinct design ng tile flooring nila. Deeper into the restaurant is the bar area kung saan naman mas lumalabas yung modern at luxurious na Asian design influence. And yes, you can now dine and drink from 11am onwards. Here's the bartender meticulously garnishing our cocktail orders with organic edible flowers. But the current lighting doesn't really do the drinks justice. Ayan, much better. The cocktail in front is called a watermelon highball and meron itong sake, watermelon, at elderflower. Bukod sa bulaklak, it's also been garnished with mint leaves. Yung watermelon parang jelly flavor ang dating niya, pero hindi naman too sweet or candy-like. May pagka-fizzy but without any strong astringent quality. Refreshing. The second drink is called Sakura which contains gin, strawberry, and hibiscus. Parang adult version ng yogurt shake kasi it has that thicker blended consistency and some tartness from the strawberry. There's only a hint of gin aftertaste. So masasabi kong yung cocktails nila are smooth in addition to looking very pretty. And now let's talk food. The resto's head chef, Luis Higa, is a Japanese national who has lived in Peru for decades. Kaya gamay niya na yung fusion ng dalawang cuisine. We started with the tiradito, parang cross between sashimi and ceviche na sake ang pangalan. Fresh Norwegian salmon with cucumber over wasabi mayo. Sakto yung balance between the fresh and spicy flavors. Kasi with wasabi alone, may tendency na maging maanghang to the point na na-overwhelm tayo ng spiciness. This takes the guesswork out kasi perfect na yung timpla. Lengua katsu yung unang main course namin at sagana sa texture at flavor ito. Yung mismong beef lengua, fork tender. No exaggeration, you can cut it with just your fork. Pero yung katsu breading na natiling malutong kahit na hindi pa namin agad tinikman. The sauce is a stew with mushrooms na may bakas ng curry flavor. This dish is served with creamy potatoes so you can order rice separately for your mains. Pescado, gambas, al ahilyo yung pangalawang main dish. White fish na in this case lapu-lapu, pan-fried to develop a crust outside while still staying tender inside. May shrimp sa ibabaw. This is served with butter garlic sauce na may emphasis on the garlic kaya malasang malasa. And the capers add a fragrant tartness. And as usual, here's a look at their full menu, starting with cocktails and other drinks. Feel free na i-pause to get a better look at what they offer. Overall, I would describe Haponesa as an impressive juxtaposition. The interiors have a casual feel, but the food and drinks are at fine dining levels. The fusion of Japanese and Peruvian cuisines are seamless because it's well thought of and harmonious in flavors. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.